before we begin, big shout out to Casper Z for actually uploading the glitch. I actually got the idea from it. I got the tips and the, all the tricks from him. So yeah, make sure to check out his channel. It'll be in the description below. Yo, what's going on guys? It's Inferno. So I'll be showing you guys a god mode glitch in Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War Zombies. So pretty much I showed you guys a glitch already, for, but I think it's got patched already. But there, now there's an updated bit way to get it. And this glitch is super easy to do. Get god mode. It, you get it every single time. Like super easy to do it's on die machine obviously uh yeah so pretty much let's get into it so yeah guys first what you're gonna what you guys want to do is turn on the power to build the pack a bunch machine okay then you guys want to go and locate the parts for the either scope your first either scope part will spawn in the exact same room that your anomaly spawns in okay so right after you pick up each part you'll notice that several plague hounds will spawn in so you'll want to take care of them immediately and you want to locate the remaining two parts of the, the two parts of the either scope locations okay so pretty much guys the two spawn locations can be one underneath the stairwell or two on this plane part on the crash site you'll now want to make your way over to the crafting table just beyond the pack of machine and assemble the either scope and pick it up okay so it's extremely important that you pick up the either scope before the next step otherwise the anomaly required for the glitch will not spawn in the speed cola room so you will now want to go ahead and shoot four out of the five blue orbs that are required to activate the coffin dance easter egg if you're aware, unaware of the locations of the blue orbs you can simply follow the exact path that I take on screen and shoot the orbs in the exact order that, that I do. So it's important to leave the last orb behind as we do not want to activate the easter egg scene right away okay. So I should also recommend that you get making sure that the orbs actually disappear before you run into the next one. So yeah because sometimes you can shoot it and uh, you might not realize that you missed. So yeah pretty much just make sure that you shoot all the orbs. We are now ready to get into the glitch. You want to ensure that the following round is going to be an exfil round which happens every 5 rounds. So for example, uh, right now for me, it's gonna happen on the sixth round and uh, yeah, you want you'll then want to kill the last zombie of the round Go up to the anomaly hold your interact button to enter the dark either So while you're teleporting you will now want to run over and shoot the last orb Okay, so once the last orb disappears you will now be in the coffin dance Easter egg Make your way over to the speed cola room head over to this desk pick up dr. Vogel's diary Once you pick up the book make the, the megaton wall spawn Okay, so I would simply just just run around make your way over to this corner hold your interact button twice to give dr vogel his diary you'll want to do the exact same thing for the second ghost which can be located in the trial room and the last ghost can be located directly in front of the crafting table so in order to get this glitch working every single time you want to ensure that the ghost is still out and taking it taking uh while it teleports you out of the top coffin dance easter egg so a big problem that many people had including myself is that we all rushed to get all the three ghosts spawned and activated with this variant of the glitch you'll be you'll want to take your time when running over to e activate each ghost and and you want to ensure that the last ghost is still out and talking right when it teleports you out of the coffin dance easter egg. So this will basically trick the game into thinking that you're still talking to the last ghost. And the game mechanics will then divert to the zombies away so that you can listen to what the ghost has to say. So once you teleport out, you'll notice that the zombies will not go after you. They'll just pile up in certain spots. If you leave the underground area completely and come back on later on and ar around, uh, you'll actually be able to pick up the loot box and the god mode effects will not revert You will also be able to pack a punch your weapon and pick up any power drops that you want, might want to pick up Okay, so if you run directly to the loot box area once it teleports you out of the easter egg You'll notice that zombies will start attacking you again and the god mode the god mode will be cancelled So yeah, that's pretty much how to cancel the god mode if you don't want to have it anymore So yeah, the the updated this is an updated version still works after patch 1.0 6 the last one doesn't work anymore so yeah i saw a lot of people were having trouble with this glitch so hopefully this will sort it out you'll be able to do it for yourself so i hope you guys did enjoy this video if you did i would greatly appreciate it if you could drop a like on it also if you want to be the first one if you want to be the first to be notified when i upload videos like this make sure to hit that subscribe button below until next time next time it's been inferno i'm out peace